Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Devil Survivor 2 Record Breaker and the first thing we're gonna be doing in this episode is going to the Cathedral of Shadows and making a new demon for us to use. Now off screen I got this Wendigo and well, we're gonna be using him for something a bit later but yeah we're gonna combine it's to Nike which we've used for like a quarter of the game at this point and a Jack Frost to make this Orthus. And just be warned, you're probably going to want some ice skills coming up soon. I'm not sure if I'm going to pass ice dance onto this Orthus or not, and eh, this looks pretty good. But just keep that in mind. And the reason that we're doing this is, honestly, we just need to get rid of these demons. They're past the point where they're going to be helpful, and now is the point in which we need to get new ones. And me, beast, Orthus, me, good guard dog, you work hard. Uh, th th thank you for the compliment, Orthus. I hope we work well together. But yes, keep in mind... You're gonna have to start shaping up your demons. Honestly, I've been super lazy about it. My demons are horrible for this point in the game, and let's actually do this. So we're gonna put these new demons in, and crap, I can't change my main character. What I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna give my good demons to Eo and Daichi. I'm gonna give myself the scraps. You'll find out why that is later on when we do the battle in this episode, but we're not at that point yet. So to get to that point, we have to do some feats. So let's start with Eo's. Demon Inquiry. Hmm, if that's the case. Ah! Oh, it's you. You surprised me. Oh, well, I was just thinking. You know how our summoning app lets us control demons? We don't really know anything about what demons actually are. I've summoned demons so many times just to stay alive. I think we should give it some more thought. Thanks. The demons first showed up when this calamity started, right? I get the feeling they must have something to do with the cause. Hey, where do you think demons are when they're not summoned? Oh, I see. Then maybe it's better to ask, how do they appear so quickly when we summon them? Yeah, that's the part I can't figure out. One moment they're not here, and the next... Well, there they are. How can that happen? Yeah, I guess it is pretty similar. Using the terminal, you can be in Tokyo one minute, and then Osaka the next. For someone in Osaka, it would seem like you magically appeared. <laughs> That's pretty amazing! But... How does the terminal work, then? Oh, right. I could just ask someone in Gyps. Let's see. Who in Gyps would know about the terminals? Maybe Fumi? Yeah, I'm sure Fumi would know. I'll ask the next time I see her. Thanks. I'm sure we can figure it out if we keep investigating. Let's give it a try. Hmm. Eo actually brings up some good points about demons and how they operate, and how they are pretty similar to the terminal system. Makes you wonder, maybe they're connected, or maybe they function on the same properties. I guess next time we run into Fumi, we should ask her. Like right now. So let's ask her. Um, aren't you that girl who was with What's-His-Face? Need something? Uh, um, well... Uh, oh, you surprised me! Oh, hello. What's this one's name again? Sorry, my memory is taken up with important things. Ah, right, right. Mio, that was it. It's Eo. Eo Nita. Oh. Are you sure? 
Well, whatever. Uh, anyways, I came to ask about the terminal. Mm -hmm. Remember we talked about how when demons are summoned, it's a lot like using the terminal. That's why you're here? You want to know how the terminal works? We're very curious about it. <sighs> Fine. The terminal wasn't completely developed in-house by Gyps. It runs off Oparts, passed down through the chief's family. His ancestors were missionaries to Tang China during the Nara period. Oh, right. Oparts means historical artifacts that are too advanced for the period in which they were found. The one powering the terminal is interesting because of the neutral oscillation in particle physics that it can cause. When amplifying the power to a certain level, a physical change occurs in certain affected matter. Uh, did I say something strange? What about that didn't you understand? Um, everything? He understands. Are you dumb? Um, could you explain it in a really basic way? <sighs> Alright, I could try. It breaks matter's data down into teeny tiny matter bits, changes those bits into a signal, and sends it flying through the air. Then, the receiver uses those teeny tiny bits and rebuilds the matter into normal sized bits. Ugh, this sounds so stupid when put in such general terms. What nonsense. Yeah, I think I understand now too. But, is breaking a person down into information even possible? Hmm? Of course. Everything in this world is made of matter based on information. Exactly. More than half your body is hydrogen. 25% oxygen, 10.5% carbon, and... Um, we've heard all we need to, right? It's getting late, and we should go. Thus, of the 29 elements in your body, 98.4% is composed of these four. The remaining 1.6, well... So, Gyps' teleportation device is powered by magical artifacts that Chief Hotsuin's family found in China. Yeah, it's a lot to take in, and honestly, it's kind of... I don't want to say dumb, but it's one of my major complaints about Devil Survivor 2. It's just like, yeah, it's so much to take... I don't know, it's not really that big of a deal. Then again, it is a fantasy game and whatnot, but we're not done yet. We need to level up Eo's fate for something that's going to happen later in the game. What is that? Well, you'll just have to see later. What? Oh, it's you. I was, um, just trying to sort out what Fumi told us about the terminals. Really? <laughs> That'd be a great help. Thank you. Um, we can start with what Fumi said about everything boiling down to information. The terminal can transport people because we're information too, right? So, what about demons? Good! That's what I thought too. I mean, demons appear out of thin air, right? Wouldn't that suggest their data is received from somewhere and recreated here? Whew. <laughs> I'm glad you agree. If it is true, where would Demon's information come from? Yeah, when the terminal sends people, there's a specific departure and arrival point. Then... Are demons somewhere else before they're summoned by the app? Hmm... 
We can't say for sure because there's no way to confirm it. What if they're all related? The demon's home, the disaster's cause, and the Septentrions. Hmm, I wonder, what is there that connects them all? Oh, sorry. Um, I'll think about it some more. We still don't know a whole lot, but I think we made some progress. Thanks. And all right, that gave us a lot of reputation with EO that we would have normally have, so it's good we got that. And ooh, apps and muggers are up next. And it's kind of an easy battle, but I still need to save. And okay, now that's been taken care of, let's initiate the next battle. Now, I'm gonna warn you prior, make sure that you have some good demons on EO and Daichi. If you don't, this could be a problem, and it's also nice to have one demon with devil speed. I recommend Garm, he's still pretty good at this point in the game. But now that that's all been discussed, let's start the next battle and crack some skills. Give me some, please. I'm about to starve. Me too. I haven't eaten in days. Please, no pushing. Don't worry, there's enough to go around. Um, only one per person. I'm sorry. Huh? Oh, hi. Perfect timing, dude. Can you help get these people before the line? Thanks, it's a huge help. This is getting much crazier than we thought. It's just too much for the two of us. Um, a lot of people don't have anything to eat. That's why I suggested sharing a little of the Jip's food. It sure isn't. This has to be kept secret, especially from Makoto. Whoa! What are we gonna do? I didn't think this would get so out of hand. Out of the way! I'll kill you if I have to! Ah! Hey, something's going on over there. This food's ours now! Or do you want me to sick my demons on you? Uh, ah! Ah! What should we do? They have summoning apps! The food! We got the food! <laughs> no! Ah, bastards! They took off with the food! What do we do? R right! We can't let them get away with this! Whoa! Uh, wait, wait a sec, Eo! I'm coming too! Damn it! I wanted to pass out supplies so I wouldn't have to fight. Wait, wait! Please give us back our food! Haha! <laughs> Dumbasses! Huh? Yeah! Oh man. You guys! Keep those bastards from getting too close! Give us time to escape around the back. You got it. Time to run home, kitties. Crap, crap, crap. What are we gonna do? Maybe we should just give up. We... we can't give up. People need that food. We have to stop them. Eo? E Eo? Damn it. You're a feisty one, eh? I guess I might have to give you a little scare then. Eo! Daichi! Hang on, I'm coming! Why does Hinako want to protect Daichi so bad? 
Is my ship finally cannon? Okay, I'll stop. <laughs> but yes, this is the apps and mugger battle. It is a complete joke, guys. There's really nothing here that should be too terrifying. But this is why I gave the Wendigo and Orthus to my main character and made sure that... Who did I? Oh, yeah. EO has good demons because they are going to fight the majority of the people here. And me and Jungo are going to pretty much pick up the scraps. So let's see who we want to crack what. So now that me and Daichi have the joint crack... Um, I think I'm gonna met him to get Grimoire Plus and also Plus Stone from this guy's unit. By doing that, we'll crack everything there, even if I'm not present, which is actually pretty handy. Let's see, Jungo can get... None of, I don't really care about any of this, to be honest with you. I guess Weaken is okay. It's pretty much just the opposite of Blitzkrieg, and yeah, I kind of want... I'm kind of want all the boosts, but now that I have, like, Ice Boosts, I should be fine. And you know what, that's actually looking pretty good. So let's deploy the units. Me and Jungo are forced to start back here, so that's kind of a bummer. But Daichi and Eel, well, I get to choose oh, which of these two squares do you want to choose? And it's like, well, you can only pick those. Anywho, let's start the battle. This one, like I said before, is super stinking easy. If you just have the foresight and plan ahead a bit, and is she serious? He was going to fight them? If she has to do it all on her own, I gotta help her. Well, that's rather, um, I don't know, courageous of you, Daichi. And yeah, this is the guy I want to fight. So. If we can get plus stone, Daichi's full form will basically be, like, realized. Because this guy specializes in status ailments, but so does Daichi. And we're going to take all the stuff that we get from him. Not really the Grimoire plus leader skill, but basically his plus stone skill. And let's see, can we kill? Okay, we did not one-shot that. That's totally fine. Mow down will connect. That's not the end of the world either. And okay, we're not taking too big a damage. Hopefully the bizarre... Whoa! Okay, we got stone. That's really good. Um, wow, I did not think we'd get both skills like that. Uh, I thought that was looking like, you know, a round, uh, two rounds. And okay, C crap. I'm not sure. I'm, no, oh, I just remembered this is not stack. Okay, that's not a big deal, but Grimoire and Grimoire Plus do not stack. But we're going to remove that skill in place of Stone Plus. Stone Plus, I will hopefully get to show off. It is just th one of the best skills. With well, honestly, Hinako and Daichi, I never really pointed it out, but... Their skills are basically the same, it's just Daichi has a little bit more agility and Hinako has a little bit more attack. So, if you like using Hinako, you can do the same strategy on her. And yeah, me and Jungo, we don't get to do a lot in this fight. And please give us back the food! You're not the only ones who need it! <laughs> oh, okay, he always seems very frustrated. And she should be able to crack the skill from this... Yeah, okay, she does have that uh, really easily. Just to be on the safe side, though, I'm going to awaken in the case that uh, Jack Frost doesn't have enough magic to take this guy's team down, but I'm pretty sure EO still has a Lech Dance, so we should be fine. The Battle Aura... I don't know, man. I don't think it's going to save you necessarily. You can go for it. Nice. Re oh, God damn. I just realized I should have got Ice Dance. I keep doing that. I keep putting Ice Dance on my hero when he should have a Lech Dance and vice versa. So I got... I will break that habit eventually, guys. Let's see. The Mabufu. It's gonna one-shot the Mizuki. That's what I like. Awesome. Awesome. I can't even I can't even say the second half of my own name. Okay. Thor should be able to one-shot this guy. King Frost, you don't even need to intervene. Your Highness, please, please step aside. Let the commoner deal with it. Then again, no, he actually did need to help. So I retract my previous statement. But so far this battle is going my way. We got three of the four skills cracked successfully. And Daichi finally has plus stone, so that's pretty good. Get, 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 get out of here. Put that cigar out, by the way. There's children. I mean, we're technically 18, and we're not considered children anymore, but you get what I mean. And what? You want to fight me? You want to fight me, young man? Don't make don't make me break out in a village people song. Get it? Because, young man. So, okay, I'll shut the heck up. <laughs> that, was the that was the next level of corny. So I could assassinate here, but I actually want Eo to get some decent EXP. So I think I'll just, you know, take the battle normally. And okay, brutal hit missed. I'll take that. And that's that. That's all they got. They don't want to use Mabuf. They don't want to do any magic, I guess, because of uh, King Frost. And hopefully we will. Oh man, we we almost took them all out, but we got a little unlucky there. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. You'll get the level that she wanted. She didn't get the max amount of EXP, but that's okay. And these kids are so powerful. Yeah, yeah. Get out of here. We already know. Gosh, and okay, now my only concern is, can I get to that guy fleeing with the box before he exits? I did give Daichi Garm for this very reason, but there's still a chance he could mess up and oh crap. I just realized I need to not beat these guys into a bloody pulp because 
Jungo needs to destroy the leader, so I'm gonna I'm gonna hope that this doesn't kill him. It might. Oh gosh, that did a lot of damage to Orthus. Comes the Petra Eyes. Luckily, I have resistance to those spells, and okay, that's not a lot of damage. Hopefully, my main character does not destroy him instantly. Wendigo doing next to no damage. That's because he does not specialize in. Oh God. Okay, we lucked out super hard there. Wendigo just guard perfect. So we set this up. Just basically optimally for Jungo. There's no way he cannot crack this unless he gets Glamour. Eh, that doesn't really heal that much. I'm totally fine with that. So now we just need to use Garm's uh, Devil Speed. Get to that guy. And now you will finally see why I have specialized Daichi in being such a status effect monster. That is because Stone in this game is pretty much an instant kill with a combination of either Zahn or multiple hits. So my multi-hit here is going to do so much damage, and it's only going to be worse, actually it's going to be better, once we get uh, Petra Eyes, and oh gosh, I, I can't even wait, We're, look at the florist, he is going to explode from this, and if he doesn't, the forest dance will finish him off, so let's just use our routine attack, and <laughs> God, I love that combo so much, sorry, I, I literally squealed like a little girl or some bulk, I don't care, as long as the enemy is not resistant to just status effects, they die. Daichi can just one-shot people. It is very rare for the, you know, nerdy, you know, best friend character to be useful in a Shin Megami Tensei game. Looking at you, Yosuke. Okay. Yosuke was good too, but you know what I mean. Daichi is a wrecking machine now that he has these tools, and he's only gonna get better once he gets more agility. And come to think of it, I should have kept him with Hustle because that increases the amount of multi-hits he can do. Anyways, or was it multi-strike? I don't- I always get those mixed up, but yeah, Jungo. Do us a favor and knock this guy out for us. And all right, we have Weaken, er, Weaken? I think, yeah, it's just Weaken 2. So if we want to give a similar effect of Blitzkrieg to someone else, now we have access to that. So now there's only one guy to take down. This guy, this guy is everything weak to ice. You're going to get destroyed, dude. <laughs> it's like, yeah, I got Marksman. I'll take you all on with my Pyrojack and Orthus. I planned out my team for an extremely long time. You know what? Screw it. We're just going to use Desperation here. This basically is like a self-destruct, and I haven't actually seen it. Well, that does look pretty cool. I've, I was about to say, I've not seen it in a while, so I kind of forgot what the spell effect looked like. So basically, you sacrifice all of your HP to explode, and you win. It's pretty cool. And all right, we beat him. Oh, not him. Just We, we beat everybody, cracked the skills. Good job, everyone. All right, I'm bushed. Seriously, no more battle today. Daichi's going on the bench. Mm hmm So did you. It's thanks to you we got the food back. <laughs> Man, we managed to pull through, but I never expected that out of fellow humans. I guess that's just how it is with the disaster and the food shortages. It's like the city's getting worse and worse. Everything's spiraling out of control. I don't think passing out food will solve anything. Things like this will just keep happening. <sighs> well, we did manage to teach them a lesson, so there's that. We're really lucky that you showed up, dude. Yeah, thank you so much. Oh crap! I totally forgot the truck! Gotta go! Alright! See you later! <sighs> What's the matter, I? You're not your usual feisty self! Oh, it's nothing. Just... Things are so bad in Tokyo and Osaka right now. You're right. Buddha's getting scarce. Nowhere seems safe. Resentment towards Gyps is getting worse, too. I don't like this. I know it can't be helped, but... Hmm? An email? It's easy to I and you, too. Oh, no. Don't tell me...
Now it's Joe's turn? What do we do? Hey, guys! Did you get the video just now? Where's Joe? Oh man, what are we supposed to do? Wait, duh, we can just call him. I'll tell him we need to meet up. Damn, no good, it's not going through. What are we doing? I wonder what's wrong. At this rate, Joe's gonna... Oh yeah. Wait a moment. I think I know that place. Oh, I know! That's Nagoya! Centering Park! Really? You're absolutely sure I? As sure as I can be. That's where Joe's gonna die. Alright, let's hurry and get over there. We gotta find him! God dang it. Not Joe. Anyone but Joe. I know the anguished one is right there and it's everyone's favorite character, but we are gonna find Joe no matter what. Where could he be, though? We need a hint. We just need something to help us figure out where he is. Like the like the fate Joe lost. That'd probably be a good place to start. I can't find Joe. Looks like he hasn't been through here yet. Where the heck is he? We still can't get through to his phone. He's probably okay. We should keep looking. I'm gonna save him this time. Let's find Joe. He's supposed to show up at the weirdest moments, but now that we actually need him here... <sighs> Please, forgive me! Hey! That voice! Was it Joe? Let's go check it out! Ow! Oh, what are you doing? I'm a pacifist! A slip is nothing next to what I had to go through. I nearly died! I'll protect you with my life. That's what you said, wasn't it? Except what you meant was I'm gonna run away like a coward! No, 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 baby. You got it all wrong. I can't kill demons, so I was going to get help. Okay. At full speed, leaving me behind? I have had enough. You turned around to apologize while you ran. It wasn't like that, babe. I was trying to tell you I'd be back. You really expect me to believe that crap? Ooh, tough luck, dude. It wasn't Joe after all. What should we do? Actually, maybe we should say something. I know it's not our problem, but this area is pretty dangerous. Like, like I was saying, you got the wrong idea. I was just trying to show the depth of my love. You can't open your mouth without lying to me. I will never forgive you for this. Hey, um, sorry to bother you guys. I can totally see you're right in the middle of something here. What the hell do you want? Whoa, hey, don't shoot the messenger, lady. Well, what I meant to say was, um, if you're gonna fight, which is cool, you might want to do it somewhere else. Butt out, kid. Isn't this a public park? We can argue wherever we want. Sh sure, and, and I totally respect that, but it probably won't be long before demons start showing up. D demons you serious, bro? I barely got away last time. I'm out, baby doll. Hey, you stay safe. Hey, get back here. Why can't you be more like that guy in the flat cap who came to save me? There they go. Do you think they'll be okay? Don't worry. My boss says the more a couple fights, the closer they are. She talked about a flat cap. Maybe she saw Joe. Oh, yeah, maybe it is him. If we look around some more, we should be able to find him. Let's keep at it, everybody. All right, we finally got a... Well, I can't really say finally, considering we just found out about Joe's death video and then just kind of found a hint to figure out where he is. But hey, I am relieved. And in the next episode of Let's Play Devil Survivor 2 Record Breaker, we're getting Joe back, no matter what. And save him from his pyro jack fate. Hmm, what a way to go. <laughs> Anyways, see you guys in the next episode. Bye.